it's Nancy today. I keep driving by this spot and I see there's trees that have been cut down. And then up there where you see the snow, there's also a whole lot of trees that are missing. And I'm curious about what the beavers have been doing. Well, it looks like this is where they've been putting some of their stuff. Where is their dam? Is this it? Is this the dam? It doesn't look much like a dam, does it? It's not very deep or very big. What about on the other side here? The objective then would be to have it filled with water on this side, right? But it isn't. Maybe it's waiting for the water to come. Maybe it's going to be the meltwater that comes down through the hills to get stuff up there. I mean, they do have something happening there. Now, were they just taking this down to eat it? I mean, see, it's very, I guess it's going that way. Those look like good logs for table legs. But do you know what surprised me is how far away they went to get their water. I mean, to get their sticks. You know, now he, if they're over there, they have to walk all the way up here. Now, beavers have very short legs. Look at where they went. They climbed on the hill up there. And they're very far away from protection, you know, to run back to the water if something bad happens see someone cut this but you can see that the beavers the beavers were the ones that cut the took the ends off see they've taken those off of that hill too it's very steep for beavers and over here now this is what was so surprising is that they've this is a a little aspen grove. You can see where their track is, where they've the, that open area where they walked in, and they cut all these trees. But it, how did they get them? You know, you can see that they did.